If you've ever made a massive base, you know the struggles of the ups and downs of navigating them. This video is about to make that much easier. Let's bring some more power to your base with the elevators in Rust. This tier 2 item requires 3 HQM, 200 metal frags, and 1 gear per elevator. Before we get into the deets, hit that subscribe button if you dig the video. For my example, place 3 floors of elevators, one on top of the other. From here, you want to power the motor with 5 power. To do this, simply connect your battery or a branch with a 5 power to the power in port of the motor. You'll be able to now hit the front panel buttons to go up or down a level, or the side panel buttons to go all the way to the top or bottom. You can stop here if you like, but I'd suggest adding buttons to call it to the floor you need a lift at. To do this, you simply add a button to each floor. Wire the power out of the button to the call elevator button on the side of the elevator. Now, no matter which floor you need access at, you can call the elevator for a quick pickup. The elevator has two entries, and depending on your base, you can set up a button on both sides of each floor and call from either end, making it even more accessible in the base. In terms of the setup, that's all you're going to need. Some basic info should be mentioned on top of connecting this elevator. The elevator allows two entries, but you can isolate this down to just one if you'd like. Walls and door frames can be utilized as protection while in the elevator. I suggest garage doors on any entry to the elevator. The max amount you can stack is currently 11 before needing to add another column elsewhere in the base. This used to be 6 I believe, but they've since changed it. This should be plenty for most bases. And please, don't become a roof camper with my tips, or I'll hate you and I hope you get raided instantly. The elevator only requires 5 power and when you stack levels, the elevator moves up the shaft leaving empty space on the floor beneath. You do not need 5 power per floor, which helps with power expense. Whenever you pick up or destroy a floor, the floors above break as well, not the floors below. A handy piece to recognize when creating this simple machine. Lastly, this item will crush you, so don't stand under it. With that said, I hope you elevate responsibly, using this power as intended, to save time getting around your base. Not to roof camp, alright? Anyways, if you like me or whatever, make sure to subscribe for future vids. And also, join my Discord in the description for chill talks and rust chats. Until next time, gang, enjoy some elevator music and get back to it. Happy rusting, my friends, and I'll see you on the next one.